What is up, everybody? I am back playing even more Temtem. It's been a while, hasn't it? Um, I saw that I had some notifications, actually. How do I open those? Oh, here we go. People want to be my friend. I'm going to accept all of them. Yeah, now I got some friends. All right, now I need to advance through this fire gym and kick some ass. I got my water guy ready to go, and I got my... Uh... Let's do a little bit of a roll call, actually. It's been a while since I played. I got Umishi and Scale and Gonki and Burbis and Spreel and Shard. Spreel and Shard should not fight these guys. Gonki's kind of like my backup. Same with Burbis. I want Scale and Umishi to get the most experience here. Oh god! Oh! Jesus! That was a little scary. Oh, you want to fight? We share breath, Tamer. Usually you would find a warmer welcome to this dojo in the true Miraelian style, or Miraelian style. We're all a bit on edge with all that scientific expedition business. Hmm? Yes, our apologies. We pride ourselves in being welcoming to visitors and fellow tamers, but these days, we're too concerned, I guess. What expedition? What are you talking about? They arrived a couple weeks ago, bossing people around and acting kind of shady, and then they vanished. Oh, they're talking about the Belsodo. Yeah. Lady Lottie's a jerk. And they took the Dojo Master's elevator key. Really rude strangers, so everyone is a bit wary of out islanders. It's very recent. But enough chit chat. You want to speak to the dojo master, and we should be honing our temtem skills. Let us temtem up. Okay, let's temtem up. I haven't done a battle in a while now. I see. I feel like it's been a week or something since I played some temtem, and I'm ready to kick some ass now. Let's go, Umishi and Scale, my boys. Oh man, I'm pretty freaking underleveled. But I'm gonna go for a big nuke onto Raze. I want to catch one of these guys though. I want some fire on my team. Also, holy crap, that was a lot of damage. That was a lot of damage, too. Kill him quick. No, Umishi. Umishi's gonna die. I can't have that. Embers is a really good move. Yikes. Yikes. Dude, Dindri is gonna mess up my Umishi. And that hurts my feelings. I'm gonna try to heal Umishi at least so we don't die. God dang. If I just bomb him, he'll die, huh? I gotta bomb plus him if I wanted to live through this turn. Come on, Umishi! And baby! Allergic spread. Oh, baby! Yeah, if I just did a regular bomb, he would've been dead. Holy crap, they're so fast! Why are they so fast? Oh yeah, they got priority on their moves, huh? I forgot about that. At least I can get some experience here. Yeah, there we go, Umishi. That's a good boy. Yeah. Now, who do I throw out now? I don't want to throw out Gonki, because Gonki's been carrying me through everything. I want to get some experience on some of my other dudes. However, Umishi is just... Oh, God, there's two of them? Oh, no. Oh, jeez. What do I do here? Cooperation? Um, equalizes all team members' stamina. Uh, put some speed onto Burbis, I guess? That's really all he can do right now with his given stamina. And I'll try wind bursting the lower level Deandre. Try to kill him. Yeah, Omishi. Sorry, dude. You were a goner. I hate to say it. It's an unfortunate outcome. But sometimes these things happen. At least I'm doing decent damage there. Frick. Do I send in Shard? Do I send in Spreel? Try to get some experience on him? That's probably the best call. If he could become a Deandre also, then maybe he'll kick some ass as well. But what do I do on these guys? Do I lower their speed? Do I just nibble on them? I think nature into nature is not a good call. Oh shoot! I got a I got a play here. I'm gonna sharp. I mean shrill voice. Both of these guys. That wasn't too much damage actually. All things considered. Ow! You stop that at once right now, young man. These people are hurting my feelings, and they're hurting my tem tem. Not a good combo. Okay, I'm just gonna do a regular Bomberoni onto Burbo. And do a... I'm not doing too hot in the uh, stamina department. However, I think I can KO this guy. This Deandre. Oh, crap. I was gonna try to KO him before he attacked. But that's fine. I mean, I guess that's fine. He did, at least. At least he did. So now it should be a 2v1, right? Because that guy doesn't have any more Temtem to throw out? Oh, never mind. It's another one of these assholes. These god dang fire guys. Demoralize. <gasps> That's a good ability. It's a really good ability. What the heck? Okay, well that Dangery was overexerted. Now he's not anymore. Oh god. 
Yeah, japers. How do I deal with this raise? He's gonna start effing me up. Same with the Deendry. Maybe I just go YOLO onto him? Although I'll KO myself. The overexertion is gonna be real unless I just do basic attacks. Look at me doing no damage. Look at him doing good damage. Jeez. Purpose, no. I'm thinking Embers is probably gonna kill, actually. <gasps> oh, friggin' burn. Look at me. I'm like zero damage, god damn. All right, well now it's time for me to throw out my final two heavy hitters. Oh jeez, I need a train or something. My Temtem are not up. Um, how about... Hmm. How about this? Chain Lightning onto you, Crystal Dust onto you for the priority. I'm thinking this might not kill the Deendry, but Chain Lightning will. Oh shit, now Chain Lightning's gonna hit Gonki. Oops! That was not a good call, actually. Ugh. And now he gets the super effective embers onto Shard. Ow. Well, just like every other battle in my life, turns out Gonki's gonna save my skin once again, because he's so good. Um, Headram... Hmm. What do I do here? I'll go for a Headram, I guess. That should be enough to KO him, assuming Shard lives. <gasps> Shard lives! Or does he die at the end of this turn? Headram! Does the burn damage come in and then does the experience land? Oh, damn it! <laughs> Why is it always Gonki the only one getting experience? That's a bummer. Impressive. Rawiri will want to see your skills for himself. <sighs> He's not gonna want to see these skills. I'm kind of dropping the ball here. You should see Rawiri. No! I, want I should open this item is what I should do. Average crystals? Sold for a good price. I like that. Sounds good to me. Vigorous Loquat. 40% hmm. HP and 40% stamina. Cool. Uh, should I just like jump into the lava? Nah, I guess I'll try to go back. Fuck! Oh, scary stuff. Can I even fall into the lava? I don't think I can actually. It won't let me walk off into the lava. So if I try this, it won't let me go. What happens if I stand on a platform when it reaches the end? Do I die? Let's see. I'm always interested in this. What's the punishment for failing? Whoop. Oh. You just go back to the start of the gym. Okay. I was afraid of, like, falling into the lava and dying. <laughs> oh, Excuse me for being so irrational. Uh, pardon me for being afraid of the fucking lava. Okay. Where was that friggin', uh... Where was that friggin', uh... Where's that friggin' uh, Pokemon Center again? Did I say the P word? Uh oh. Where was that Temtem Porium? Temtem up? Yeah, that's it. I'm gonna heal. So I was thinking I could get good experience onto my water guy, aka Umishi. But I also feel like right now, uh. Is he too level? Too low level? I'll try doing another battle, and if he gets effed up again, then maybe I, uh. Hmm, maybe I can't tackle this gym yet. We'll see though. I'm gonna go for it. You better believe I'm gonna believe. I'm. You better believe I'm going to believe. Can I just go this way? I think I could. I don't want to though. I want to get some of that free experience. All right, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Oh yeah. Give me those items. Oh yeah. Think you can outdo this newbie, Sima? With pleasure. Oh, that wasn't a whole lot of dialogue. I'm kind of fine with that though. Oh, here we go. Whoa, it's another little fire guy. God dang. I want to get some fire guys on my team. Water cannon's going to do significant damage. Uh, sand splatter, I think, is actually super effective. Embers is a jerk move. Ow. Water cannon for the big bombo damage. Hell yeah. Don't you be doing that onto my guy. Oh, come on, man. Oh, I'm not even enough for the KO. Shit. Well, I'm in must I'm in much worse condition. I want Umishi to get experience, dude. And these friggin' assholes over here ruining my day. Um Priorities? Ah, oh, that's a low priority. High priority, but doesn't do damage. My highest priority here. Oh, I think I need to heal. I really want Umishi to get experience. I mean he does have the EXP share after all. You know what? Screw it. I'm gonna switch him out to somebody who resists grass and then does scratch have high priority which one of these is the highest 
Uh, I guess I'll just go for a Fierce Claw and a Cap Hire. Get out of there, Umishi! <laughs> I want you to live, boy! I need you to live! I need to get some experience onto him. Scale dead. Okay, cool, he's not. Although he- oh, no, he's dead. Ah, shit. God dang. These people are just brutal. Okay, um... Spreel! You know you gotta get some experience onto this guy. Gotta get some EXP onto all of my guys. Did Shrill Voice have a higher priority? I think Peck has extremely high priority, so we'll go for that. And Spreel, how about you just, um... What could you even do? Could I lower the enemy's speed? Would that be helpful? I'll try it. Lower that Typhoo speed. At least Capire is dead. At the very least, we got that. Now we can get some of that delicious experience onto all of my boyos. And, now you're a slow little idiot. Haha, <laughs> look at you. Oof! Friggin' neutral damage. Oh my goodness, what do we got here? That ain't bad. That ain't bad at all. Oh, another one, great. <laughs> Time for me to get hit by embers again and again. Hmm. Well, he's obviously gonna be using a fire-type move onto Spreel. But then what do I do here? Do I shrill voice both of them? Try to maximize damage that way? Do I do a switch here, or do I just go out swinging? Spreel might just need to go out swinging, if anything. I'm predicting that they're gonna use embers, but Umishi probably can't even take an embers. God dang it. Umishi! Why you gotta be this way? Um... I guess... You know, F it. I'll go for the allergic spread. Yeah, he's... is he dead? Okay, cool. He's not dead yet. He's almost dead. But he's not dead yet, and that's important. Yeah! Look at him doing no damage. Oh yeah. Now here comes some real damage. Ow. <gasps> Overexertion though, nice. No longer burned. Uh, Feathered Gatling does a lot of damage. I want that cap, cap iron dead since Typhoo got... Uh, Typhoo got... Uh, Overexerted. I need Burbis alive, so I'll... Heal him up. Spreel, uh, I'm sorry. It's an unfortunate consequence. I'm kind of bummed that they keep on throwing out uh, nature types and fire types. I'm trying to figure out, like, what to throw in. Hmm. Out of all of these, I think sending in shard makes the most sense here now. I really just need Umishi to not die. Putting the EXP share on him, smart. Throwing him into all the battles afterwards, not smart. Believe it or not. Does pet kill? Please tell me pet kills. Frick! Sh <laughs> Shucks. Dang. I kinda would've liked that to kill. Oh, never mind, that's fine. They can just kill themselves. Cool. <laughs> right on, dude. Right on. And they got another overexertion? Fine by me. Look at these assholes always throwing out the same two Temtem. Look at these assholes. Let's kill him. I say we kill him. There we go. And then I can use, uh... Yeah, since he's overexerted, it doesn't really matter so much. Now that he's in peck death range, I can just do this repeatedly. Sharp leaf? Does that kill? Cool. Doesn't. Yes, get some rest. That's right. Rest on up. Oh, wait. Is he gonna overexert here? I guess that's still kind of worth. It's whatever. It's whatever, man. Oh, look at his little eyes. I didn't catch that before. Toxic farewell. Hey, what the fuck? What is that? Put that down. Stop that. Cut that out. Right now. Oh boy, here we go. Oof. And Burbis dies now. Ah, shit. Ah, shit. Yeah, shit. Uh, go Ganky. Gonky. My boy. I believe in you. Um... Uh, Noxious Bomb, I guess. I mean, that's really all I gotta do. And you know what? You can just wait, Shard. This battle's over. This battle is donezo, man. Got him, baby! <laughs> you better believe I got him. Ooh! Not that easy, was it? Mm-hmm. It wasn't that easy for me either, man. I get, I'm getting my shit pushed in. What's this? <gasps> Ice Cube? Dude, the rapper from Are We There Yet? 
Damage taken from fire techniques is reduced by 20%. Is that a whole item? Cooler. When you want to chill and be cool at the same time, heals a burn ten ten. So wait, what is this ice cube that I just picked up? Excuse him all? It is a hold item. Reduces damage taken by fire techniques 20%. Who would even be worth giving that to? Spreel? Maybe give it to Gonki right now on account of the fact that he's my hard carry. Umishi has the EXP share. Scale has the runaway. Shard has the undoomable. I mean, I guess Gonki can take reduced fire damage. I mean, I am in the fire gym after all. Hmm. Oh god, what does this do? Oh, that snares you when you stand on those. Oh. I thought those were just, like, platforms you couldn't walk on. I didn't realize I was gonna get ensnared. Oh man, Umishi, what are we gonna do? What are we gonna do with you? Let me pet you. Oh yeah. <gasps> Look, there's a little bird! Aw. Hell yeah. What's going on over here? Oh shit. Hello friend, where are you heading? Um... I have a Tomescence file. I'm just going for a walk. Nothing wrong with that. But this is the cable way. I'm afraid it's just for locals. You need to get a special key to use it. And given the circumstances, you aren't getting one. Okay. Understandable. Have a nice day. Cable machine broke. Understandable. Uh, I'm going this way. Because I gotta heal up again. I mean, I guess I could have just used my Tomescence file. I still have to adjust to having that. It's a really cool item. But at the same time, I'm still so used to the... I look back at his name's Pokemans. I'm so used to the uh, Pokemon Centers and not having Tomescence Vials. The Tome Oh god, I just did it, didn't I? The Tomescence Vial is a really cool item that I would like to see make it into Pokemon games. But then again, you know, maybe we don't need to play Pokemon anymore. Maybe we just play Temtem. Let's make our own monster capture games, guys. I mean, come on. Come on. You saw how everybody reacted to Pokemon Sword and Shield? We just make our own shit. Make Temtem. I want to make my own monster capture game and put that on Steam one day. That'd be sick. That'd be sick a uh, Let's change the squad up. Hmm. Aw. So, if we're going into the gym leader, I'm probably going to get my ass handed to me, but I'm going to give it a try. I might as well at least give it a try and see how impossible it really is. Oh, come on. Don't be that way, Jim. Why you got to be that way? But, um, ugh. yeah, if I can even do a dent of damage to this guy. Oh, come on, where's the, where's the freaking platform, man? Uh, is there a pattern here I'm not recognizing? So there it is. Oh, shit. Okay, maybe that was correct, actually. So I don't step onto this one, and then I wait, and then I step onto the next one, which is now. Hmm? Excuse me. These platforms are quite rude. Okay, let's figure this shit out. Here we go. So there's... Okay, cool. And now here's the good one. Oh no, that's the bad one. Okay, now here comes a good one. Come on, baby. There it is. Aha! I made it. Well, let's see how this goes. Hello, Rariri. Do you want a battle? You gonna kick my ass? So you're that new tamer who's defeated all my pupils. Uh, I am. I'm Thundaga, and I come on behalf of Sophia. Oh, is that right? How do I know that's true? Why would I lie? Why, to steal my key, of course, like the last bunch of foreigners did a while ago. You're talking about Clan Bel Soto? They're a bunch of jerks. Those so-called scientists came asking about how to get to Anok Volcano. Next thing I know, my cable key, my cableway is gone. They're gone. And old Anok is having the worst eruption since I was your age. I should have known better than trusting strangers. Sophia is the only trustworthy non and What? That's a lie. I'm trustworthy. And you? I don't know. Tempt him up. Ooh. May, you know, maybe I will learn his trust. Oh, God. He's going to spank me real hard, though. I can already see a problem here. Oh, is that a shiny? Is he has a Luma? Holy moly. Okay. Well, I need to feel about... I need to think about how I'm going to deal with his... I should probably focus on the Luma, although Deandre is kind of an asshole. I'm gonna Feather Gatling the Luma and Fierce Claw the Luma, because Lumas are guaranteed to have pretty good IVs, I imagine. I think they are. Like, they're guaranteed to have three perfects. I'm gonna take a sip of my drink. I got some strawberry lemonade, by the way. Oh, baby. Mm -hmm. mm. Pretty good damage. I could probably actually just do that again and kill him. Ooh. Ow. Dude, this music is good. Holy crap. Oh, Rage. Oh, you're super dead now, buddy. 
You are super dead now. Oh no, his attack has been raised. Darn, if only I wasn't already focusing him. Ooh! Into Shibuya. Get him out of here, baby. Get him out of here, baby. And Umishi with a little bit of bonus experience. Magmus. Oh, that's that little guy. Aw, I want one of those. They are kind of cool. Hmm. Now I'm going to go for something crazy. Check this shit out. I'm going to Feather Gatling, Magmus, and then for my item, I'm going to use a... Do I use Tonic? Do I, don't, don't I have any Tonic Pluses? Let me check... Medicine. Here we go. There's one. Tonic Plus onto Burbis. There we go. Crazy Strat. So now I can afford... Oh, ow! You're kicking me in the head, dude! All right, well, at least he's overexerted. Warm Cuddle, what's this? Are you gonna burn somebody? Whoa, whoa, whoa! Well, I think I've been hit by that before, actually. Okay, so far, not terrible. Hmm. Since Burbis is in, I have the uh, gem combo here, so I'm gonna go for Shard. I think I can do this. I can Shrill Voice both of them and Crystal Dust. No, I don't want a Crystal Dust Magmus, actually, because he's fire, obviously. And fire's good into Crystal, so I'm going to Head Ram him, I guess? I want him dead. I want Magmus dead. Get him out of here. Okay, he's dead. <laughs> I always love it when the enemies use Rage, because, like, I don't know, sharply lowering your defense? Fine by me, buddy. Fine by me if you want to be doing that shit. All right, and Deandre's overexerted, which is perfect. Banapi? What are you? Have I seen you before? Oh, kind of cool. Uh, I'm not doing too good on my... Oh, it's only level 18? Hell yeah, I'm gonna focus on Deandre now. He was overexerted last turn. So let's just uh, beat the shit out of him. Decent damage, not bad. Allergic. Ow! I'm allergic to the spread. Wait, you overexerted yourself again? What are you, dumb? Ouch. Uh, no. Pyromaniac. Eh. Okay. Um, what do I do here now? Do I Shrill Voice and then Tonic? That might be the best use of turns. Although, maybe I should heal. Spend both turns healing with some Tonics? How many Tonics do I have? Oh. I know that Burbis... Burbis is doing pretty good. I'll hit him with a regular tonic. And Shard's not long for this world. However, the longer he can survive, the better. Might as well use these tonics in battle. Come on, baby. Heal up boy number one. Healing up boy number two. Now, what are you gonna do? Embers, ouch. Ow. Okay. At least on an overexerted turn, I get to do some cool stuff. Hmm. I think it's best, actually, for me to Feather Gatling you and Crystal Dust you. Oh, shit. Don't kill Shard. <gasps> no, I need Shard to live there. Oh, man. Well, he's, he's going to overexert again, isn't he? What an idiot. At that point, I might as well just ignore Deandre. He's going to be spending most of this battle KO'd. Ow. Burbus, no. Burbus. Oh, they're both double. They're double overexerted. Cool. That means that I can start going for a victory maneuver here. Aha! Uh -huh. Gonky boys. I'm not doing too bad in this fight. I'm going to Shrill Voice for the double KO, and then I'm going to pop another Tonic onto Burbis. Tonics are so good, man. Holy crap. I'm really digging them. Double KO. That's so satisfying. All right. One down, a two down. Now what else does he have left? I'm thinking he's got he's got to have like his big boy still left. Rise and Typhoon. Oh, he doesn't have any big boys left. Rise and demoralize. Great. 29. Jesus. All right, these are these are his big boys. Who do I focus on? Do I focus on Typhoon? I think I focus on Typhoon. I'm just going to throw everything at Typhoon to try to blow him up. Cheer up. What's this? What are you doing here? What was that? Oh no, don't you be burning Gonky. At least I put the Ice Cube on him though. That's pretty good. That's gonna end up being hella worth. Yes, focus on Typhoon. Kill that guy. Kill that little guy. Yeah. I took like no damage that turn. 
that's pretty good. All right, Peck is doing really good stuff. Oh, I'm gonna overexert here if I do that. Shit, and I don't have any tonics left, do I? Ah, come on. Do I have anything that restores stamina? I do, actually. Um, 20 stamina. I could just pop an ether onto Gonki with this turn. Because I don't want him to be overexerted, that's for certain. I mean, I'm not using these ethers anyway, right? So ether onto Gonki, Noxious Bomb onto Typhu. Kill that guy. Also, I'm sorry, I keep on bumping everything. I bump my mic all the time. Shit. I need Gonki to not die. Gonki, fuck! Shit, that's bad. Friggin' Botanophobia, screwing me, man. You're screwing me over here. Do I revive Gonki? I could win this, assuming Gonki doesn't die. Uh, he's gonna be low on stamina after that, isn't he? Ah, uh, crap, he's not. Um... Okay, I have enough for a shrill voice. And then, Spreel, for your turn, I need to pull some lame strats and revive the one and only Superboy, aka Gonki. And I use that ether on him and everything, too. God dang it. Fire Tornado. What the heck is that? Whoa! Whoa, 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 whoa. Hey, fine. If you want to burn all of your stamina for an ultra move on my little crappy guy, be my guest. That's fine by me. Bark Shield? Oh, come on. Are you raising your team's defense? By two levels! Crap, that's good. Ah, that's real good. All right, I think this is still winnable, though. Rise is overexerted, and Typhoon's a little bitch. However, I've got bomb pluses. So I drop a bomb plus onto Gonki, and now he's guaranteed to not die, and Typhoon is gonna die. And I think in a 1v1, Gonki beats uh, Rise. Oh, he overexerted himself to cheer there. Okay, that's cool. Now you're dead. Now you are dead, my friend. Damn, I thought I couldn't have beat this gym, but I'm doing pretty decent. I mean, I'm I'm using a shit ton of items, but at the same time, like, I don't know, I'm doing decent damage. I'm he I'm being hella carried by my items, though. Peck ya boy. Uh, DC beam ya boy. Let's see. Respectable damage. Eh, not that respectable. Fire tornado. Shit, he's doing it again. Okay, well, he's at least he's overexerted. Come on, Gonki, you can pull through, baby! That's my boy. That's my boy, yeah. Just kill yourself with overexertion, dude. Oh, man. It's kind of a bummer that he KO'd himself. I didn't get the satisfaction of finishing him off. Oh, well. Rawiri, I did it. That. That was. Hmm, those moves. I've only seen one tamer do that. <gasps> 720. Dude, I did a 720 kickflip nolly nasty move. So Sophia did send you after all. Yeah, like I said, dude. What about the stolen keys? I wanna, I wanna help you, dude. I, uh, let me explain. So, well, you see, the true initiation ritual in Om Omninesian tradition involves a pilgrimage to the Anak Volcano to receive the blessing of the goddess and catch some fire Temtem. -tem. But old Anak is in the fiercest eruption I've seen since I was a child. And also those scientists stole my elevator key. So things are complicated. Um, tell me about Anak. I want to go there and catch some cool fire type Temtem, -tem, dude. Old Anak is fierce, but fair. She destroys and creates, but she's usually good to us. The fair winds blow away the worst of her fumes, and we're left with fertile new land. Mm -hmm. It's uh, very unusual for her to get into such a rage without any prior notice. Usually there are signs you can notice, changes in wind and smell and tremors, but this happened overnight, out of nowhere. Hmm. It's gotta be Bel Soto, those assholes. Hmm. So, well, I do have a spare elevator key, just in case. Since you're a friend of my dear Sophia, I guess you can have it. Thanks. I'll take that. No problem. You've earned it. Oh, yeah, baby. Oh, yeah. Thank you. Rawiri's key to the elevator that connects to the three regions of Omninesia. Let's go. So, Thundaga, since you're heading to the cableway anyway, could you do something for me? Uh -huh. Can you look into eh, whatever's going on at Giant Banyan? At the Giant Banyan? It's an important place for our culture, and I keep hearing that someone has been harassing our people. They're out-islanders, and since you're obviously not from around here, perhaps you can find out more about it. Mm -hmm. I can't leave the dojo alone, especially now that Tihani is still abroad, so could you help me with that? Sure. I'm gonna look into the giant onion. I mean, Banyan. Yeah, I'll check it out. I'm always down to help. Thank you. You're pretty okay for an out-islander, you know? Yeah. 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 I did it. 
Well, I was fully expecting to get spanked, but I think I did a little bit of spanking on my own. I pull, I barely eked out a victory there, so it all worked out. I guess next thing I gotta do is go to this uh, G-Dang cable way, figure out what the heck is going on there. Also, I need to sneeze real quick. <coughs> holy moly, holy moly guacamole. Oh man, I'm having a blast still playing Temtem though. I need to buy some more freaking items, Jesus. I'm running out of tonics. Give me some tonics, baby. I got smoke bombs, fine. I got a lot of sense, damn. 10 cards, doing pretty good. 10 card plus plus, doing fine. Bomb pluses. Those are so expensive. What the heck? Why are they so expensive? Ether plus, nice. Power revive. Um, tonic pluses. Tonic pluses are like busted. I can only afford two. God dang it. I need to make more money, man. How do I make more money? I need to make more money. It's not even funny how much I need money. Anyway. I think this is a good natural stopping point for this episode. I'm gonna say thank y'all for watching once again. And uh, until next time, you guys, I hope that you all have a good one.